What's happening, ladies and gentlemen? It's the Multitasker. Welcome back again to another reaction. It's time to get back with Dragon Ball Z Abridge with episode 42. As we left off, Piccolo's been sitting and patiently waiting on Kami to, to fuse in order to defeat 17 and 18. Meanwhile, Trunks discovered there's another, and I quote, the identical time machine that he once came in and still has it in his pocket. And now he wants to take a look to, and observe to see if it's legit real. And by the way, yes, I did watch the history of Trunks. It was funny. And that made me question about the the future Gohan because that poor that poor soul. I I can understand that the the loss of the friends, including Piccolo, that drove him insane, that he believes that, that he somehow is talking to him in his mind, but not really. That's that's actually sad. Anyways, let's go ahead and get started with this episode. And most of all, it's time to react. This is the best you've got. That is our top of the line. How do you like it? Like is a strong word. So let's tolerate. Hate's actually looking a little weak right now. Oh, but darling, you look like the most beautiful rose in the rose garden. I'm sure if I came home with you, my daddy might even love me again. And that is my cue to leave. What? Later, cowboy. Ah, sweetheart, you gotta pay for those. Okay, cash or credit. The register's on the inside. You are getting into your car. You are driving away, and I have been robbed. You blind bimbo, you get back here this instant. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> All right, we should be getting close to the site. Um, Mr. Chunks? What's up? If you don't mind me asking, you know me in the future, right? Yeah, actually, you were my mentor. Oh, wow. What does adult me like? Well, I suppose you take a lot after your father. In what regard? You're the strongest, bravest <laughs> warrior on the planet. Okay, good. Mm, By the way, don't forget. why do you keep staring at my arm? Oh, uh... Hey, what's that? Oh. Oh, yeah, oh you can't say? <laughs> Obviously. Well, this definitely looks like my time machine, but it also looks like it's been here for ages. Ooh, a mystery. I never get to solve mysteries, like Sherlock Holmes or Batman. Usually we're just busy finding people, like Bruce Lee or Batman. Hey! Oh, look, your mom's here. Oh, God. Gohan and son mother <laughs> so is that your time machine well it looks like mine but it can't be mine mm. this one here is the one I used to travel back in time with if you'll notice it has the word hope written on the side so unless this one has it written in the same place we oh crap baskets it's the same. oh you say that too Wait, why hope? Because you called me our last hope. Holy crap, that's so cheesy. What, do I have, like, a ton of cats, too? Hey, anyone else notice the hole on the top? Huh, weird. Do you think whoever was piloting it was attacked? Actually, I don't think so. Considering the curvature of the melted glass, combined with the lack of any glass or damage in the cockpit, we're safe to assume whatever shot the canopy came from the inside. And what does that tell us? Um, that the blast came from the inside. Here. Huh. So, any idea what these are? Oh, I think I kicked an alien that looked like that once. Hey, let me get a look at it. I want to help too. As the daughter of the world's leading class scientist with doctorates in both bioengineering and evolutionary biology, I can only deduce that this is a mutant coconut. Either that or an egg. An egg? <gasps> I know! Trunks! Whatever made that hole hatched from this egg. You keep examining the time machine. I'm gonna go search for clues. 
Well, at least one of us is having fun with this. Two of us. And then they flew off! God only knows where they are now. Thanks for letting us keep Goku here, by the way. Yeah, that's nice. So there's a hot one now. Oh yeah, like you wouldn't believe. Her eyes are this beautiful, piercing blue. Her confidence is stunning. And she does this adorable little thing with her hair where she brushes it out of the way. Fantastic, how's the rack? Uh, Master Roshi, Goku's sweating purple. Is that normal? Did he eat grapes? I don't know. That boy can't handle his grapes. Speaking okay, of fruit, what are we talking here? Apples, good. oranges, melons? Is that really important? Yes! Apparently. Oh, hello. And what are you? Hey, Trunks, I think I found a clue. Either that or a record-setting cicada. I'm okay with both, actually. Ah! Oh my god, is that thing alive? No, pretty sure that this is just a molt. Something crawled out of that? Hey, if you guys don't want it, mind if I take it home with me? Whatever was in here might just Why? be the creature that came out of Why that did ship. Why you need it? Oh. Oh, no. Oh, really wish I hadn't. Considering oh, how fresh this head. molt is... It's likely that whatever oh, shed its sticky. skin did so very recently. Yeah, know, meaning that it might very well oh, still no. be here. <laughs> Trunks, it was good to see you again. Go on, say hello to your mother. I'll call you later. Okay, bye! Long the shot, but you wouldn't have to shit. carry hand sanitizer on you, would you? Do you, do you not? It's a no. Ew, 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 ew. Ew. <laughs> Oh, you guys are by Ginger Town, right? We were. Why? Because there is some major shit going on down there. Shit of what variety, exactly? The not good kind. This is Flash Stormwind reporting live for CQTV here on location in Ginger Town. Well, thank you, Flash. What's the situation down there? Mass unadulterated panic, Hal. Just moments ago, screams erupted throughout the streets only to be followed by deafening silence. Now there seems to be nothing left but a ghost town, littered with the clothes of its former inhabitants. We have yet to find out the reason why. Well, do you have any speculations, Flash? Well, Hal, I cannot say for certain. However, recreational marijuana use was recently legalized in the region. So I believe we can all come to the same conclusion. Just a moment, someone is approaching. Excuse me, you terrified looking gentlemen. What are your opinions on the legalization of- Oh my god! <laughs> wow, someone should probably go check that out. Yeah, my stash is running a little low. <laughs> hey guys, we're back. What's that smell? Is there a skunk in here? Oh, hey, Gohan. You like mysteries? What? Do I? Oh, my God. Did, did Roshi just shit himself? Hmm? Okay, so you felt that one, right? I did. And you're still just going to put this off? I might. All right, I've had enough of this. I have literally been sitting here meditating. Dozing. Meditating <laughs> for the last... <laughs> Uh... Three hours! Thank you, Mr. Popo. <laughs> Three hours! So either shit or get in my body. I... No! Listen, I still this need to feel shit. the situation out. What the hell no. is there left to feel out? Between your cryptic warnings and jerking me around, I'm pretty sure an entire city is either missing or dead! You're the Guardian. Start acting like it! Yes, I am the Guardian. The Guardian of this planet. And you wish to take that title from me? Are you kidding me? This can't be about the job. The first chance you had to drop this gig, you tried to hand it off to Goku. Goku! He doesn't even look after his own kid. I look after his kid more than Sadly, he does. But, but it's still my job. My responsibility. And that's really good and all. But if you don't fuse with me, the entire world you're guarding might be destroyed. Maybe I'd rather it be destroyed than ever have to be a part of you again. Mom? Whoa. Dad? Please stop fighting. So that's what this is all about, huh? No, no, that's not what I- No, no, it's fine. I was kind of a dick. I get that. Listen, Piccolo. I've been the Guardian for over 300 years. I've seen wars, sickness, death, and worse. All the while trapped on this lookout, unable to interact with the outside world for more than moments at a time. 
Now the only chance I have left is giving up my free will to someone else. It's just another prison. Wow, I... Wow. I didn't... It's fine. I'm done anyway. You're That's right. So if I don't do this now, we are likely to lose everything. But know this, Piccolo. Once I fuse with you, the Dragon Balls will be no more. Ah, that's not a problem. We've got a whole planet of our people just waiting to make us more. What do you mean, our people? Stop being a smartass and let's just do this already. Well then, Mr. Popo. I suppose this is goodbye. It's been... a trip. Uh, uh, yes! <laughs> <laughs> well, still, I'm sure you're still already familiar the with the technique. Right. All right now. Lower. Yeah, not falling for oh, that. please, don't, <laughs> don't. I didn't think so. <laughs> oh my god, I'm coming down! <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, that was crazy. So did you actually eat Kami, or was that the acid? So this is who we were, huh? Also, now you're acting, coming back. Hello? Come to your senses. Got real quiet. Holy crap, are they finally... <laughs> uh, of course no. not. <laughs> Isn't this the part where you chat to yourself? <laughs> Shut up. Come now. We should do whatever feels right. Oh, please no. You can win! You feel great! You <laughs> can do this! <laughs> hey Piccolo, could you pick up Yanto while he doesn't have a... Ah, crap! Well, I know someone who's not getting invited to Sunday brunch. Oh, who am I kidding? We like him. Well, only one thing to do. Turn down the No, 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 no. Now the lids are surely gonna shout racism over this one, but this is just the what fuck? happens when you elect a dog as king. So you think this is whatever came from that egg trunks? Definitely. This isn't the work of the androids, that's for sure. Not unless they're starting the world's first mandatory nudist colony. I'm going to go down there and check it out myself. I'll oh my admit, God, after everything that's happened, I'm a little bit worried I'm responsible for these events. Wait, are you sure you should go alone? The only other person strong enough to help us right now would be my father. And even if I knew where he was, which I don't, I'm not sure he would help us. No, you see, I didn't f up. I just underestimated her. I went in a little too overconfident. But of course I was a little overconfident. I mean, have you ever met me? I'm me. I'm a big deal. And you know who's really at fault here? He's the talking boy. to himself, isn't he? Oh, the future oh. is so bad. Well, maybe it wouldn't be if you weren't such a pansy ass. Now, once I get back in the game and destroy those metal brats, there'll be nothing left to get in my way. Oh my god. <laughs> well, this is classic. The moment God disappears, suddenly the rapture happens. Yes, the irony is not lost on me. Could you guys stop talking for a minute? Oh yeah, I don't want to distract <laughs> you. Like you hit by one of these abandoned cars. I've always wanted to drive a car, but by the time they were invented, eyes weren't so good for it anymore. Piccolo, you've driven a car, right? How was it? Wait, seriously, shut up. What is that? Mr. Samus. Oh my fucking lord. A dream. <laughs> Make him the cutest that I've ever seen. Give him two lips like roses and clover. Then tell him that his lonesome nights are over. Hello, friend. <sighs> uh, hi. Yeah, I definitely do not want to send friend requests to sell. Not with that singing. But there you have it, folks. That was episode 42. Oh my god, Trunks. My biggest question is... How come you don't have a hand sanitizers? I thought the future was capable of... You know what? I'm not going to go over there because I... It, it, it's, it's pretty bad over at his timeline, so I, I keep forgetting about that. But... He, he still hasn't 
forgotten that be, being almost solicited by his own mother, which that's still that's still funny and it's still just a on a on a little creep zone. And I got and I gotta say, every word's coming from Kami. That's that's kind of little kind of sad and at the same time it's just he rather just stay at the at the lookout rather than be infused with, with piccolo out of all the people because technically they are one of the same but they don't see eye to eye which that's pretty obvious and vegeta uh sweet christ I think being as a Super Saiyan, that's literally that that is just it's just clouds him, just too much of overconfident and just entitlement. I think it's, I think it's just getting a little out of, out of hand there, but anyways, that's all the time I have. So if you enjoyed this, let's leave it the likes and leave a comment down below. I'm Mighty Avengers signing out, but I will catch y'all in the next video. So peace out, everyone.